Alvin Kamara last two games has finished as a top 10 running back. Uh, despite you know, the issues at quarterback, we see Andy Dalton, you know, getting the start and the new Orleans losing to the Cincinnati Bengals this week. But uh, Alvin Kamara has now handled 19 and 23 carries each of the last two weeks. He's on pace to, to break last season's record of 240 rush attempts, right? He is well on his way and it's the, the receiving that is concerning for me uh, for Alvin Kamara, only 25 receiving yards on six, uh, six receptions. He did have nine targets, so it's good that Andy Dalton is looking his way, but he's not getting room to run, and that's bad when Michael Thomas, Chris Olave, and Jarvis Landry are all out for this New Orleans offense. They just couldn't seem to get the ball moving uh, in the way that they they want to and, and be successful here to, to get pull out the W, right? Taysom Hill was pretty limited. Hill only completed two passes for like what 15 yards and also rushed for 40 yards. Camara is a low end running back one moving forward. I, I don't know what else to say. Like as long as some of the wide receivers are out, he's going to get the high target share nine targets in this game against Cincinnati, but he didn't fall in the end zone. If he would have, fallen in the end zone he'd be the running back three on the week behind only jackson and stevenson so you know we'll see what the future holds for this new orleans offense when they're going to get all of their weapons back but as long as they do camara is a pretty solid back end running back one